Hey, I'm back. Just ready to say continue. Um, there's going to be another, uh, you know, walk on the dark side. We're going to be talking about yet again uh, the Mandela effect. Uh, you know, I know this is. I'm amazed at how much this topic has blown up because um, it really is a, a new topic which really resonates with a lot of people. Uh, you know. I don't just post YouTube, I, I watch a lot of YouTube, um, and kudos to all of you that are YouTubers that are putting out, like, really cool, honest, um, you know, material, um, you know, I, I really dig your stuff, but, um, so, I got, I'm, I'm going to be talking about one specific, uh, um, case of the Mandela Effect that no one said anything about. I, I picked this up. I kind of, I want to, you know, share it with you guys, uh, see if any of you remember this. <clears throat> but, you know, with the election going on, uh, they were talking about Hillary and her husband, Bill. Good old Billy boy. <laughs> um, and I remember... Um, back in the day when, you know, the whole Monica thing going on about, I mean, it was a big fiasco. And it was like, should we impeach him? Should we not? And I was shocked when they were talking about it uh, on news uh, this past week that uh, that they were like, um, you know, he was uh, the second prison to be impeached second right yeah uh, because of Nixon was the first I was like wait no no I I specifically remember um, that <clears throat> like with the whole fiasco going on that they were like talking about impeaching him not impeaching him and you know, ultimately, you know, him cheating on his wife really, it doesn't, I mean, it's personal life. It doesn't affect the government, his job, you know. <clears throat> and I remember <clears throat> uh, very specifically back in the day when this was going on, I was in favor of not uh, impeaching him because I felt as though it, uh, you know, right or wrong, it doesn't affect anything. Like, you know how many people, like, in Congress or whatever, like, day to day, so many people cheat. I mean, it's, it's not a good thing, but it, it happens. And, you know, by that right, I mean, it's not, like, a, a, a crime. Like, like, if I were to be married and cheat on my wife, like, my job can't fire me. So why is that, you know, the president would be, um, would lose his job over it? It's bullshit. I remember, uh, like I said, I was in favor of keeping him in, because I actually liked the the Clinton years, you know. Jobs were good. I, you know, um, you know, I remember always having money in my pocket, always having a job. Um, we weren't at war. That was a huge uh, uh, plus, and um, but I remember when. Uh, when it came through that, uh, because so many people were like, oh, he should be impeached, he should be impeached. And when they didn't, I was like, see, see, he, I was right, it, it's not justifiable to impeach him. So when I found out that, it was like, holy fuck. Like, yet another thing that, um, you know, got changed, it was like, this just squeaked by. I couldn't believe that even, you know, that no one 
has said anything about it um, yet. <clears throat> like, because I, like I said, I watch YouTube a lot. I watch a lot on the Mandela Effect because I really, like, I like doing these. Uh, it's a topic that I love and I like to talk about it, but at the same time, I don't like to rehash too much because um, it started with one video and I was at the time it was like very new to me so I was like okay I'll do this and then I was like well I already started and I tried to do a more complete um, list of everything I could find um, so I did the second video but I really wanted to, if I was going to continue doing these Mandela effects, that I wanted to bring something a little new to the table. And I wanted to find at least stuff that not too many people were talking about. And and lo and behold, there it was. It was like, it's like no, I, I so specifically remember it. Um, I remember, like, I remember even saying something to my mom. I was like, see, they didn't impeach him. I, I, you know, I, you know, I, I was right, you know. There's no reason to, to impeach him. He's not that bad of a president. He really wasn't in the big scheme of things, like, compared to, like, <clears throat> you know, the Bush years and, uh, you know, what we're currently going through, and, you know, the Reagan economics, you know, Bill Clinton was a, a nice, fresh face, and, uh, you know, I really backed him because, um, you know, I, I was very happy to see us not in war and all that, and, you know, someone that came out and addressed the public uh, very frequently and I thought that though he was still you know not a man without flaws um, you know yeah I mean his presidency still had you know there was still like other stuff I mean all our presidents do shady stuff I'm sure even our forefathers did some <clears throat> crazy stuff I'm sure even Lincoln did you know, some shady business back in the day, but because, <clears throat> you know, <clears throat> without social media back then and, you know, everything being kind of word of mouth, um, you know, it's not well documented like things are today. You know, you do one thing and it's like all across the net. So <clears throat> I'm sure like there's probably like some sort of brands about like, shit that I said even it's like look at this motherfucker dumbass motherfucker thing said like you know time or whatever in space and multiple dimensions are colliding and <laughs> resulting <laughs> in uh, alternate timelines it's like or you know whatever um but you know so this was this one really resonated because I it, it was something that I so specifically remembered and uh you know uh and moving forward into um you know I want to keep doing these Mandela effect videos I'm going to really hunt down some stuff um it, it, before the Mandela effect even kind of came around I, I can't, I wish I knew what this was. It was, um, I was listening to some sort of song. It was something that I listened to a lot when I was, um, in high school. And I hadn't heard it for a while. And I was listening to it. And I mean, like, this song, I, I listened to, like, a lot, a lot, a lot. And, you know, I was in band, so, you know, I would memorize lyrics and, you know, like, I'm very notorious for being able to quote um, song lyrics because I'm such a move or a music enthusiast. And it was like, I was singing along, I'm like, 
and like you know I, I just snapped I was like wait a minute what because I was singing along and I said th- sung like a lyric but then I caught that you know the the uh, mp3 or whatever uh, played uh, it was a different lyric and I was like no wait 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 <laughs> I specifically be- remember it being something else and I was like what the fuck I wish I, wish I, I, I took note of what that song was so I could like share it, it I I think I noticed that maybe it must have been like three years ago. That's why I noticed it. So it's been a, a, a while. No, not the Stain song. <laughs> no, not <laughs> not that. But um, <clears throat> but yeah, I'm going to um, start with, like diving in and looking at some my own personal stuff that I really enjoy and uh, seeing. Uh, what else is going on <clears throat> and as you know I like to r- ramble on and everything so uh, my little ramble on on this one is going to be a little bit of um, an update uh, to you guys now I you know I was really pumping out a lot of videos um, you know a couple weeks a little, well last month now and <clears throat> I only I slowed down. Like I was I only did like one video a week, uh, so I mean I know that I'm still new to the YouTube uh, community and I don't have like a crazy amount of followers. But you, you know, any of you that actually do follow my stuff, um, you know the reason why I haven't been putting out much material is that. Um, I do work two jobs. I'm like working this crazy amount of hours. My my one job, you know, I I work at Elks doing um, you know banquets and stuff. So what happened was it was in the off season. Now we're going into our uh, our our crazy season, and work is blooming, and it's leaving me with not so much. To you know, time, like, literally, like, like, today, I worked, what was it, I did the overnight of my one job, got off work, uh, and then at four o'clock, I had to go to the Elks, work there, I got off work there, then I came to my other job to do the night shift, and work the whole, do another overnight, and then now, um, it's at you know I get off at got off at seven, um, and I'm going back to the Elks at twelve. Uh, I think I'm out at eight. I don't know what time I'm out. I'm like in, in a fog. Even as I'm doing this video, I'm like I'm amazed I'm still moving. But um, you know. It's what it needs to get done, you know, to pay the bills. But, <clears throat> sorry, I'm like, couple past couple of days, I can't, like, clear my throat, so <clears throat> I apologize for the uh, uh, clearing of the throat. And it, to my friend, because um, we kind of made a pact that no more sorry, stop saying sorry. It's pathetic to say sorry, so I'm going to stop saying sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Before I get cold out on it, even though I dropped that word so many times. So, um, uh, yeah, I'm not trying to be rude and <clears throat> I'm trying to be a little bit more professional in my videos, but yeah, I want to do these videos, but God, <clears throat> as I'm clearing my throat more. Anyway, um, so yeah. I, I'm still going to try to do some, you know, much more videos uh, coming up. I'm, I want to get more into it. I'm going to, you know, I usually got Mondays and Tuesdays off. So I'm going to try to powerhouse, like, say, three a day so I can get, like, six videos out. I really want to get to the point where I average 
uh, one a day. Because it is easy. I mean, I'm, you know, there's no production here. It's just me and a camera, you know, talking to it. So, you know, as long as I can find subject matter to talk about. Um, and, you know, I'm interested in so much. I'm gaining interest in, like, this whole new lifestyle. I'm revamping my whole life. I'm even, like, starting to uh, turn vegetarian. This meat just isn't agreeing with me. Um, you know, uh, <clears throat> I'm not going to say it. Uh, just excuse me on that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so, uh, so yeah, hopefully you got you guys will be seeing much more of me. Um, but I'm gonna wrap this up on that note. Um, my final words. Well, of course, um, you know, comment. Please, you know, give me suggestions on what you want me to talk about. You know, uh, maybe you guys picked out uh, some sort of Mandel effects that uh, you know others haven't. I would love to hear it. I would love to talk about them. You know, this is a really fun type thing. It's kind of scary, though, to be honest. Um, which maybe I'll I'll um, dive into that on, you know, um, not so much the uh, specific Mandela effects, but um, like what it means um, or what repercussions, you know, these Mandela effects. Um, could become so yeah um and you know just anything you know whatever you want me to talk about you know I'm, I'm very open to hearing about you guys what you guys are going to want me to talk about or research so yeah oh, excuse me <laughs> being more unprofessional as I burp on camera <laughs> At least I didn't, like, let it rip. <laughs> um, so, yeah. So, ending this video, I just wanted to say um, I love you all. And, you know, show your love to one another. Like, you know, if you do one good deed to, you know, someone, you know, that brightens their day. And hopefully, you know, they pay it forward to someone else. And, you know, I can, you know keep going forward and forward and forward and maybe we can you know brian everyone's day so you know maybe this crazy fucked up world won't seem so impossible to live in and so bleak and you know i i'm finding so much more joy in my life nowadays which is fantastic i love i i went from so depressed to just, oh, I just fill my life with joy right now. It's great. It really is. It's so, oh, I'm tired as shit from working, but, oh, I feel great. And, uh, you know, help, help others feel great, too. That is my message. That is my kindness to you to carry on to others. But anyway, and once again, as I'm rambling, I, I promise I will, I will, become more professional as I go on and not ramble so much but anyway I love you all